Hello friends, I have a book called Dog in Boots. It is written by Greg Gormley and illustrated by Roberta and Guillermo. Have you ever seen a dog in boots? Dog was reading a brilliant book about a cat who wore a pair of truly magnificent boots. When he finished reading, Dog put down his book and he thought a little bit. Then he went to the local shoe shop. Have you got any footwear as splendid as this? He asked, showing the book to the shopkeeper. I believe I have said the shopkeeper, and brought out four just as splendid boots, one for each of Dog's paws. Bow wow, said Dog, I'll take them. Dog was so pleased that he went straight home to dig up his very best bone. But the new boots were not at all as splendid or magnificent for digging and they got so muddy, they looked quite awful. So Dog took them back to the shop. Have you got any that are better for some digging? He asked. I have just the thing, said the shopkeeper. These rain boots are perfect for mud. It simply washes right off. The rain boots were wonderful for digging. But when Dog went for a swim in the pond, they filled up with water and he sank with a plop. Dog took them back to the shop. Hmm, those ones weren't quite working for him. Have you got some that are better for swimming, he asked. The best thing for swimming, said the shopkeeper are flippers. The flippers were fantastic for swimming. The ducks look a little confused by dogs in the pond. <laughs> but when dog tried to scratch, they flip flop flopped around his head in a very unsatisfying way. Dog took them back to the shop have you got some that are better for scratching? He said, I'm glad you asked, said the shopkeeper. With these high heels, you can scratch and look rather fashionable at the same time. For scratching behind dog's ears, the high heels were simply divine. Unfortunately, they were dreadful to run in. He went flying head over heels. Dog took them back to the shop. Uh-oh, he's fallen down the hill. Have you got some that go a bit faster? He asked. Oh, yes, said the shopkeeper. If you want to go super fast, try skis. They go very fast indeed. I'll take them, said Dog, and he was gone before the shopkeeper could say, oh, but only in snow. Uh-oh, what do you think is gonna happen? Without any snow, the dog's skis didn't move at all. He couldn't run. <gasps> hmm, he couldn't scratch or swim. Hmm, or dig. On his way back to the shop, Dog thought some more. Okay, he said to the shopkeeper, I want something that's good for digging and swimming and scratching and running. Oh, and nice and furry too. Do you have anything like that? No, said the shopkeeper, but you do. Hmm. They're called, what are they called? Do you know? They're called paws. He's got paws already. Perfect, said Dog. 
Dog was so pleased with his nice, furry, practical paws that he scratched all of the fleas from his coat. He ran after his tail, swam around and around the queen's lake until she told him to hightail it out of there and dug a big hole to rebury his very special bone. Finally, Dog went home and picked out another brilliant book to read. This time, it was about a girl who didn't wear silly boots, oh, but did wear a lovely red hood. Hmm, Dog thought. <gasps> what do you think he's gonna do next with that red hood? Hmm. I wonder what he's going to do. The end. What a good book.